I'm so proud of him. He is like so trained. Okay. <laughs> Stay. Okay. All right, don't judge one my breathing. I just I went up and down the stairs way too fast and my house is a mess right now because I've been lazy. <laughs> but um, I hope you're all doing well. As I stated, there is going to be a couple other packages coming. There should be one coming today, so I'm super excited. Um, I'm on lunch from work right now, so just relaxing in my living room, waiting for UPS to come. Um, playing with Louie, he is like super excited and doesn't know why, but he will know soon because it's for him. Hi, babies. Hi, hi, are you jumping? Should you be? Sit. Louie. Good boy, good boy. He doesn't know that many tricks. He knows a couple, but nothing crazy fun. He knows, stand. Louie, stand. Wow, you're gonna play with me like this now? Louie, stand. Nope, he's not with oh, it. Now that you already know Louie, he's Welcome to roam free during the video, so I'm sorry if he is distracting, um, but this video is actually for him. Um, we're doing an unboxing of a little item that I thought I would share with you guys. Um, this is one of the pieces I said that we're still waiting on in transit. The other one's a little different, but who knows where it's at. It's been sitting in transit for like a week. Um, but we're going to go ahead and move forward. What I think I'm going to start doing also is um, bag of the days. I know Minx does it as well. So I thought, why not? Today I had to go into the office to pick up my laptop or switch laptops. Um, and so today I brought my Birkin 35 uh, in the Attain with Palladium hardware. And I have like a cute little blue twilly from whatever, I don't know what collection it was from or what year. I want to say it was last year. So it's just like, a, it's just pretty. Anyway, let's get started with this. Um, I wanted to unbox this here and he's just going to play with his little donut. Um, I don't know the best way of doing this. I'm not a go-to Amazeballs YouTuber, but there we go. It is a little thing from Louis Vuitton. Can you guess what it is, being that you already know it's for the puppy? Well, he's like, what is that? Um, <laughs> um, so I'm actually really shocked that it did come with a box because if you have been shopping with Louis Vuitton as of recently, um, there has been a box shortage. So I'm very pleased to have one. There is no invoice in here, which is odd, so it might be in the packaging. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and slide this bad boy open. And it looks like they came with some tissue paper. Um, no dust bag, but that's fine because we're not gonna be using a dust bag. But how freaking cute. He's like down by my feet wondering what is going on. So. Let me bring it up closer for you guys. This is going to be the Baxter collar in the PM size, not the, I can't remember the other size. This might be a little large for him now, um, but I just thought it was so dang cute. His name is Louie. He needs to have a Louie collar. Um, actually, you know what? This might work perfectly right now. So we're going to try and put this on him and see how it looks. Louie, come on. Oh, I accidentally punched him. Louie, come here. Lay down. Thank you. Let's take this bad boy off. Oh, you're getting the greatest angle of me, so that's amazeballs. I'll eventually have to put his little pride collar on. Oh, he's happy he's naked. Not for long, Louie, not for long. Um, this is probably very extra. I do have a leash from one of the older collections that matched the collar itself, so I thought this would just literally be perfection for him. Um, I'm going to put his little pride thingy on here because this will be his everyday collar, which at first I thought about it as I only want to use it for special occasions, but I also said that for my very first piece I ever bought from Louis um, because I didn't want for it to age or get old or whatever the case may have been. But I found that there's no point of doing that. It's better to just enjoy the piece for what it is instead of just try and maintain perfection. Um, so we're going to go ahead and put this on him. Come on. Good boy, come sit or lay down, you know, live your best life. And we're going to go ahead and close this bad boy up. It's going to be on the tightest one for now. But let's see, let's see, let's see. 
Fuck. Oof, it slipped Halloween. It's a little stiff. Oh my goodness. But how stinking cute. Very hard to see on him right now. But how fun. How extra. I thought the color would do really well as a contrast to his fur. Still on the brown tones. What are your thoughts, Louie, huh? You're the most extra unneeded kind of bouge level. Oh, I love it. Um, tell me what you think of the collar in the comments below. Do you love it? Do you hate it? My parents think I'm crazy. <laughs> My sister thinks I'm a mess. Um, she also has a dog, but it's a husky, so no collars to fit her dog. Um, but oh, I am in love with this. So he's gonna go play around and not even give a flip about the collar. Um, it's more for a me thing. Um, I'm gonna be filming some other videos shortly um so stay tuned to see what's next and i'm hoping that i can continue to entertain <laughs> but feel free to follow me here i'll also add louis instagram as well since he does have one i haven't been posting as much as i probably could because i've just been lazy i don't post on mine often either but i'm working to change that and really um just be a little more active i think during this whole entire stay at home uh, at first I was so energetic and excited, but after a week I was like, I'm exhausted. Like this is really depressing. Like, but we're changing that since it's not going away anytime soon. So stay tuned for more. I am rambling now. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Uh, but bye.